Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're taking a look at an update on the Grandmaster EA and my progress with this tool so far. Uh, some of you guys know that the 5.0 version came out pretty recently and uh, I've been trading it live on an account uh, on the S&P 500. Now, we've had some interesting uh, debacles here or debacles or whatever you like to call them. Basically situations in which I've been trying to deal with a trade that has gone against me. And this is a grid system. So if you're not familiar with grid systems, essentially it is a, a style of trading in which you're not really focused on entries. You're more focused on trade management. You're looking at macro overall direction. For example, I have a bullish bias on the stock market right now. And uh, the idea is I don't care so much to get the perfect entry, but rather I'm happy to take very small partial entries uh, on the trades uh, should I decide to build a position. Now, this tool is something that you know any trader can run the way they'd like. You can turn it on, you can turn it off, you can set the direction, you can set the grid distance, you can set your target, etc. So uh, where are we at with this? Well, what you can see is that where we left off previously, we had uh, taken some trades and things were going really well. And basically we made a good bit of money uh, on the account just from this little rally here. But then things started to go south. So we actually were entered into some trades that have gone against us since. So you can see I've got a long order open here a long order open here and that is currently the only two trades that are on the account but what you'll see is that price came down 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 and look at this we almost had that third grid level entry which i was kind of looking forward to i was ready to build a little bit bigger of a position there as price dipped and look how close we were i don't know how that's that's it's like a marginal amount of pips uh, before the next order would have been triggered by the bot but again this happens sometimes sometimes you know you have that pending trade and you just miss it before the big reversal but again entered here so trade number one right over here trade number two was entered here and trade number three was almost there but didn't quite get triggered so no trade number three so my average order you can see in the blue line here is right around this level which to be more particular is right around 4678 let's call it so 4678 is where i am currently net uh, averaged in on my s p 500 long positions so again i have entered partially and i know not everyone loves grid trading and i understand that's fine but for me with sort of a passive mindset i'm not looking to trade this thing every day i actually haven't even looked at this account in a few days and so now seeing price i saw that the stock market was rallying back and i checked this morning and it does look like we're pretty close to hitting take profit. Now, take profit in this bot, what it uses is it just uses a calculation of the average entry that you're at, this blue line, right? And it says, okay, well, how far do we need to go in order to close out my profit target, which is $25. So if we're able to get to a point in which there's $25 floating on the account, everything will close out and we'll add it to the balance. So uh, yeah, I I'm trading this thing on a relatively small sized account. I'm looking to just kind of get in in, get out and ideally happy to build positions on the stock market if it does produce a dip. And so that's kind of the, the main pro of this is I do have a bullish outlook on this market, whether you're trading the Euro or the Aussie or the gold market, the oil market, the S&P, whatever you're trading, if you have a, a general bias, you can use this sort of tool to essentially set up your, your positions in a way that, you know, okay, you say you wanna buy down here, how, how far do you wanna set it, etc. So for me, I have my parameters set and I have a grid system System ready in action should things continue to go down I'm happy to build that position a small bit at a time and I'm not using it's not like Martingale it's not like doubling or tripling positions or anything like that it's just adding a slight bit of uh, build up on the account basically should things dip further which I'm happy with I think to be honest I think at one point we were down a drawdown of something like $200 on this move so at one point maybe a floating drawdown of $200 which of course is not ideal but because I am looking long term and this is almost like a semi you know slow long term trading approach um 
I really don't mind a little bit of drawdown coming into the account, especially when the account is large enough to handle most drawdowns that would get thrown uh, at the at the account. So where do we go from here? Well, it is the end of the year. Right now I am filming. It is uh, December 22nd. And so we're looking at this and we're seeing markets kind of wrap up for the year. And it looks like we may have a bit of a Santa Claus rally coming in, which is basically just the idea of uh, you know, post Christmas to New Year, there's that idea of a possible rally in stock markets that does seem to happen. Um, and so the idea is, I'm, I'm willing on I'm willing to continue to hold open some trades, and maybe if we stop out, we could start the grid system process over again and start maybe even making some money going into the New Year. Very much depends on what the stock market ends up doing. But for me, with a bullish bias, I am happy to let this grid system continue to play along. And so far, so good. You can see we, we again, we had those really good orders here that were making money on the account. Things were up in profit. And then a little bit of a struggle here with this move here. And just watching as in the last week or so, the bot has dealt with this situation has been kind of cool. Now, of course, in an ideal world, I would have gotten entered into my third buy. But... Uh, again, this is not an ideal world. This is uh, the real world. And so, you know, I had that that order was ready or that the, the bot was ready to take the trade, just didn't quite get there. So I'm fine with it. In fact, if anything, it's all good because, you know, I'm, I'm still looking like the market rebounded enough. Uh, and I do anticipate that it potentially could even go higher, in which case, you know, the grid system will start back up again and hopefully we can kind of turn a profit there on the uh, the tool. Now, if you do want a copy of this tool, if this would be something that you'd like to play around with and back test and, and maybe even run on your own accounts, uh, all of the information to sign up to get a copy of the Grandmaster can be found down below in the description. I want to encourage you if you're if you're interested in bot trading, this is not like a you know it's going to do everything for you and you're just going to sit back and make money all day long. It's not like that. This is uh, real, just like any other trading, except that you know it does take components of my trading and make it so I don't have to look at the charts very often. Like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, you know, for the most part, I have not been looking at this account. This is an account that runs in the background for me and just has been chugging along and it's been awesome. So my goal is to check in on this maybe twice a week, let's say, uh, just take a look at it. And oftentimes I'm looking at it with you guys when I film these updates. So this is update number three or four, I think. So we're just kind of chugging along and continuing to let this bot play out. So if you'd like a copy, again, there's a link down below in the description. I'd like to invite you to sign up there uh, to get the bot. And if you're not already a member with us, you can actually get the gold membership, which gives you a membership within our community and the bot and everything else that we offer. Um, the idea there is that if you would like to not only get the software, but also maybe chat with other people who also have the software and who are running it within our community, it might be a nice little thing for you if you're looking for a community of traders who, you know, there's a lot of traders who trade manually and automatically within our community. So I want to encourage you, like I said, check us out down below in the description. There should be information on everything that you get with this tool. You get access to the bot. You get access to previous versions if you would like access to them. And you can get a full manual with it that kind of shows you the ins and outs of running a software tool like this on your MetaTrader 4. So if this video was helpful to you in any way, if you're looking forward to the next update like I am, hit that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Thank you very much for watching, guys, and we'll see you back next time. What's up, guys? Thanks for watching today's video. There are more videos available on our channel here and here, so go ahead and click into that for some more free trading content. With that said, thanks for watching. We'll see you back next time.